interview. It was a great interview. Actually, you heard about it first in the ninth chapter of my book. Please, Isaiah, wait your turn. And now, here on the local front, our U Witness News has learned that at least one unmarried couple arriving for the mandatory census is expecting a baby. The soon to be dad Joseph is a descendant of the royal house of David and therefore is required to be registered. His young fiance Mary appears to be in the early <coughs> stages of labor. The couple refused to be interviewed since they are desperately searching for a place to stay. The local innkeepers claim there are no more available rooms. Do not to worry, Mary and Joseph. You Witness News has set up a hotline. Anyone with an extra room is asked to contact us at Room for Truth. Once again, this is Room for Truth, right here at You Witness News. Let's show these two young people in need the great spirit of sharing that abides in our little town of Bethlehem. Awesome reporting, Lou. Do you know if they're hoping for a girl or a boy? It doesn't matter what they're hoping for. The baby's a boy. Excuse me? I said, the baby's a boy. So what are you, a prophet or something? How on earth would you not the baby is a boy? Yes, I'm a prophet. That's what I do. Don't you read? Don't you listen? The world is full of prophets. What makes you so special? Now, now, gentlemen. Let's go to a commercially safe lawyer's house again. <coughs> Star, 
farther up there seems to be indirectly at not the tip one, but the stable. Isn't that something? <laughs> and take a long look at those animals playing on the hill. Do you see in the lines and the goats playing together? It's unbelievable. Or my name's not John Gospel. Are you there, Luke?